Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the WooCommerce video series. In the previous video, I have shown you how to install the free version of this plugin and how to create affiliate program on the WooCommerce website. Now, in this video, I'm going to install the premium version of the same YITH WooCommerce Affiliates Program plugin. And I'll show you what is the difference between the free and the premium version. What are the features and the benefits of using the premium version of this plugin? If you are new to the channel and if you don't know how to install the free version of the affiliate program plugin then you can watch my previous video i'll give you the link in the description box first you can watch how we installed the free version of the woocommerce affiliates plugin and how we created the affiliates program on the woocommerce website so you can watch that video first and after that you can watch this video about the premium version so here is the dashboard of the free version plugin we have already seen how we can create affiliates, how we can set up the commission rate and the general settings, how you can set up the affiliate dashboard and payment settings in the previous video. So this is the dashboard of the admin. Now let me show you the dashboard of the user. So this is the dashboard of the user for the free version. Here the affiliate user can see the statistics of their affiliate program. They can see how many visits are there, what is the conversion rate what is the commission rate everything will be shown on the affiliate dashboard we have already seen this in the previous video now we are going to install the premium version of this plugin so let's go back to the dashboard of the wordpress website and go to plugins and click on add new i have already downloaded the premium version of the yith woocommerce affiliates program so i'm going to upload it so click on upload click on browse and this is the plugin that I have downloaded select the plugin open and click on install now this is the website from which I have downloaded the premium version plugin YITH WooCommerce Affiliates and you can see the details of this plugin here you can see the difference between free and premium I'll show you on the actual website so there are many features added to the premium version you can have more control on the affiliate program using premium version i'll give you the link in the description box for this premium version plugin if you want to purchase it you can purchase this plugin using my link and if you purchase it using my link i'll get some commission for selling this product all right so the plugin is installed click on activate plugin all right so the plugin is activated here you will see the free plugin and this is the premium version plugin now let's go to YITH and go to Affiliates. Now here you will see a completely different dashboard. So this is the admin dashboard. It's completely different than the free version. Go to Affiliates. Now here you will see the dashboard is completely changed for the premium version. Here you will see the list of affiliates in your affiliate program. You can see their earning, refund, paid, balance, how many clicks are there, conversion rate, what is the number of conversion here you can view the details you can change status to rejected ban affiliate here if i click on this view i can see the details of this particular affiliate user here you will see the details a referral link when did they apply earnings refund paid everything will be shown on this affiliate dashboard accepted additional information let's go to rates here you can set up the commission rate for each user if you want to set up different commission rate for each user you can set that up now here you can set up the commission rate for different products for each product you can have separate commission rate let's take an example i'm going to search for this coffee mug and here i can set up 15 percent and click add commission so for this coffee mug there will be a commission of 50 rupees so this is in rupees not in percentage it is in rupees or whatever your currency is similarly if i want to set up a commission rate for a particular user i can set up select the user from there and select enter the commission rate and click add commission so here you can see 15 is the commission rate for this particular user Let's go to clicks. Now here you will see the details of the clicks log. So how many clicks are there? What, are, what is the followed? 
URL, what is the origin URL, everything will be shown here. Let's go to payments. Here you will see all the details of the payments on hold, pending, completed, canceled. You will see all the details of your payment on this page. Go to stats. And here you will see the stats, commission total, total paid, total refunded, total earned. This is the global stats, average commission rate, number of hits. And what are the products you have on your website? It will be shown here. Commission rate for this particular product, refunds, how many are refunds, clicks, conversion, conversion time. Let's go to settings. These are the general settings. Cookies, you can add cookies. That was not the feature of the free version. So you can set up the cookie time when you want to expire the cookies. Referral cookie changes. Affiliate programs. So this will be the dashboard where it will be shown for the, this is for the user. You can select the dashboard page on your website and all the affiliate program will be shown on that dashboard for the user. Now social and network share, user can share on these platforms. Referral registration, affiliate dedicated registration form. So there is a default registration form which was the part of the free version. Now if you want to modify registration form, you can select this option affiliate dedicated registration form. Here auto enable affiliates, you can set up auto enable affiliates on registration. So if someone fills out the form, the registration form, the affiliate program will be enabled automatically. In the free version, you have to enable the program manually. If you want to do it manually, so you can simply uncheck this one and then you can enable the affiliate program manually. So on the registration form side, you can see the login form also. So these are the fields first name, last name, website, show promotional methods field. So how will you promote? You can ask the user, the affiliate user, how you are going to promote your website or your product. So this is the check. If you want that field in the form, you can simply check this box. You can set up terms and condition field. If you check it, you will need to enter the URL of the terms and condition here. So additional fields in become an affiliate section notify admin notify affiliate when account status change now here you can set up the global reject message if you want to reject someone's application you can set up the global reject message here global ban message hidden sections general rate this is the general rate if you want to change the rates you can use the rate panel here now here, avoid auto commission, prevent affiliate from getting commissions from his or her own sale. Exclude tax commission, exclude discount. You can also exclude certain products from the affiliate program. And you can also exclude certain users from the affiliate programs. Here you can enable the coupon handling. You can set up the coupon for particular affiliate user. I'll show you how to do this. Let's go to marketing and go to coupons. So this is the coupon. I have already created coupons in previous videos. So I'm going to use one of these coupon here. Go to edit. Or you can create a new coupon for the user. So this is the coupon 10% discount. And I want to assign this coupon for one of the users. So here you will see the option affiliates. Go to affiliates and here you can search for the user. I'm going to select this one. So for this user, I want to use this coupon on your website using this coupon code then you will know that this coupon code is designed or created for this user only so i'm going to click on update so all the commission will go to this user and they will get 10 percent discount also so you can create a new coupon or you can assign the existing coupon to different users so let's go back so these are the payment methods manually or automatically when reaching a threshold or you can set up automatically on a specific month date if a specific threshold is a reach so i'm going to select this one if the user reaches the payment threshold the payment will be auto generated for that user on a particular date of the month here you can set up the 
payment threshold and payment date here you have option paypal in the free version you have only the bank transfer option in the premium version you can have paypal as well as you can have stripe payment for the stripe you will need to install an additional plugin that is the yith stripe woocommerce stripe plugin something like that you will get that information in the documentation notify admin here you can set up your paypal payment gateway here you need to enter the api username api password api signature mail subject so you will get all this information in the documentation how to integrate your paypal account with this plugin and this is the click log so i'm going to save this option so these are different settings now let me show you the dashboard of the user so this is the current dashboard using the free version now i'm going to refresh it because we have installed the premium version now you can see the dashboard is completely changed for the premium version so this is the dashboard for the user this is the commission section from here they can generate the link the affiliate link and they can use this link to promote your products here you will see the settings here the affiliate user can enter their paypal email address here it will show the details of the clicks statistics now here you will see the option coupons let's go to coupons and here you will see the coupon code assigned for this particular user is 10 is the coupon code that we have assigned for this user now let me show you the registration form for the affiliate users now we are using the premium version and this premium version has different affiliate registration form so here i am on the website on the same website in a new browser and i am not logged into any account in this browser so let's go to affiliate dashboard and here you will see the affiliate dashboard registration form so this is the form that is created using the premium version here you will see different options first name last name email address payment email address website how will you promote our website so these are the different options here they can select and they can register using this new form so definitely there are many different features in the premium version if you want more details you can go to this website and you can compare the difference between the free and the premium version i'll give you the link in the description box you can use that link to purchase this premium version plugin so if you really want to create affiliate program on your woocommerce website you can definitely go for the premium version of this plugin so that's it for now see you in the next video do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools. If you have any questions, please leave us message in comment section and press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching quick tips.